in the land of the Lord of the Lord of the I will walk in the manner that glorifies the Lord. That I will be fruitful in every good cause. In the name of the Lord. That will please you. You will never please God. I will never please God. In the name of the Lord. That I will be fruitful. Samson to Gaza and saw there an harlot and went in unto her. And it was told the Gaza, Gaza times, saying, Samson is come here, and they compassed him, him, and they wait for him all night in the gate of the sea, and were quiet all the night, saying, In the morning when it is the day, he shall kill him. And Samson lay till midnight, and arose at midnight, and took the doors of the gate of the city, and the two posts, and went away with them, far and all, and put them upon his shoulder, and carried them up to the top of an hill that is before Edward. And it came to pass afterward that he loved the woman in the valley of Sorek whose name was Delilah. And the lords of the Philistines came up unto her, and said unto her, Entice it, and see where in his great strength lie. And by what means we may prevail against him, that we may bind him to afflict him. And we will give thee, every one of us, 1,100 pieces of silver. And Delilah said to Samson, Tell me, I pray thee, Wherein thy great strength lies, and wherewith thou might be bound to afflict thee. And Samson said unto her, I did find me with seven green wheat that were never dry. Then shall I be weak and be as another man. Then the Lord of the Philistine brought up to her seven green wheat, which had not been dry, and she found him with them. Now there were men laying in wait, abiding with her in the chamber. And she said unto him, The Philistine be upon thee, Samson, and they break the wit, 
as a thread of two is broken when you touch it to buy. So his strength was not known. Verse 10. And Delilah said unto Samson, Behold, thou hast mocked me and told me lies. Now tell me, I pray thee, where thou mightest be bound? And he said unto her, He did bind me fast with new ropes that never were occupied, then shall I be weak and be as another man. Delilah therefore took new ropes and bound him therewith. And said unto him, The Philistine be upon thee, Samson. And there were liars in wait, abiding in the chamber. And he brake them from all his arms like the threat. And the liar said unto Samson, He that wilt thou hast mocked me, and told me lies. Tell me where we thou might just be bound. And he said unto her, If thou weavest the seven locks of my head with the web. Verse 14. And she fastened him with a pin and said unto him, The Philistine be upon thee, Samson. And he awoke out of his sleep and went away with the pin on his pin and with the web. And she said unto him, How can thou say I love thee when thy heart is not with me? Thou hast mocked me this three times and thou hast not told me wherein thy great strength lies. The last verse. And it came to pass. When he pressed him daily with our word and hurt him, so that his soul was first unto death. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It's the word of God.
away and brother called you name to respect to you call the next Sunday of the month of October, which is next week. Hallelujah. So come with your act of gratitude, your act of thanksgiving, your dance steps, you know, and your envelopes, you know. Let us come and appreciate God for his grace. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Please let us remember to follow us on all our social media handles. On YouTube, Christ of Pentecost Global Ministries. On Facebook, Pentecost House. Instagram is cpgm.official. Please always click the notification bell, subscribe, like, follow, and share. May the Lord. Don't, those are little ways you are evangelizing. And like, if you don't know, for those of us that are too shy to go on the streets and carry placards, like the pastor says he wants to be doing now, but if you know you cannot do that, just Share the program on your status with your friends on your on your timeline and the Lord will bless all our efforts in Jesus' name. Amen. We have um, a um, wristwatch here that was lost and found during the praise night. So please, if any is a male one, so if any of your guests said them misplaced their watch or something, please let us know. You can either reach out to me or Pastor Lord of Peace concerning this in the male wrist watch. And I would like to also give, let us give all the kids a round of applause.
Also, um, press night was wonderful. Thank you to all the organizers. Pastor Mrs. Olajide, thank you for that beautiful decoration. That was a wow effect. Thank you so much. Um, the, the cleaning up committee, the cooking, the refreshment, the everything. Okay, yes, and everyone that supported. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Like, it's so comforting to know that we can just make one announcement and people will turn up. It's so good. It's so comforting to know. Thank you for everyone that contributed money, time, gifts, efforts, um, ideas, decoration, and nothing is lost. No, in fact, like, even those that just came to dance. We appreciate you. Thank you so much. Thank you for every time you call upon us, and we are always willing to give and support. When we call one, thousands will rise up for us in Jesus' name. Thank you all so much. I know the pastor is going to appreciate us all, but I just want to say thank you, everyone. We appreciate you. I appreciate everyone. I, hope, I wish I could give everyone a hug right now. So let me just say a virtual hug to everyone. Thank you so much. We and all those that watched online, that joined us online, thank you for always being there. When we are streaming. That note, I say, I wish everyone a wonderful and fabulous week in Jesus' name. Hallelujah! We bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah! Our God is good. We bless God. We just thank everybody for all that you are allowing God to use you for. Amen. And on that note, we pray that as we minister this morning, like I always say, this is one of my favorite times, hallelujah, of the, of the service. And uh, we pray that the Lord himself will continue to pray that holy, holy text for him in our hearts. That he will create that holy desire to draw more and closer and closer with him. That we can want to be with him or to be a few and not to be overflowed.
Did you see what happened to Apostle Suleiman? Thank God. But that is wickedness. If you be taking your wife without to settle problem, they, are, they wanted to finish him and all his family. Abba. Did everybody read, you heard about it? Not years ago, on Friday. The attack is that they kill seven people. I believe the, what saved him was he was using a bulletproof car. His children were in the car, his wife were there. Bullets everywhere. That is wickedness. Was it from another pastor? Was it from another man? Was it from this? Whatever he might have done. He said very close to Auchi or somewhere. He wanted to finish. That's wickedness. The, the scripture that we read in the book of Judges chapter 16. Samson was a man that was a power. Are you with me? He had the grace of God. Charismatic. Right? On top of the world. But the enemy got him. The Bible said they gouged out his eyes. They took out his wall. And they told me, oh, yeah, dance. Do you know dance already? Hey, hey. You know, when you read the Bible, when they say they take somebody's out eye, the beautiful thing in some people's life, that's what the enemy is looking for. That's right. The enemy is looking for the beautiful thing in people's life. They took out his eyes, put him in a chain. And they told him to be grinding. How does a commander and general be grinding in the prison? They say you are grinding. That's wickedness. Let's read that scripture. Judges chapter 16. I know sometimes you say you don't want to pray about the enemy. But they are real and they are causing havoc. Judges chapter 16 starts from verse 18 downward. Quickly, quickly, we don't have more time. Judges. And when Delilah yes. saw that he had sold Anne of his heart, mm -hmm. she sent and called for the lords of the Philistines, saying, Come up this world, for he has showed me all his heart. Then the lords of the Philistines came up unto her and brought money in their hand. And she made him sleep upon her knees, and she called for a man. And she caused him to shave off the seven locks of his head. And she began to afflict him, and his strength went from him. And she said, The Philistines did upon thee Samson. And he awoke out of his sleep and said, I will go out as at other times before and shake myself. And he wist not that the Lord was departed from him. But the Philistines took him and put out his eyes. And brought him down to Gaza and bound him with feathers of brass, and he did grind in the prison house. Amen. Amen. Delilah was a wicked woman. Uh, she she <laughs> she embodied wickedness. Are you with me? Boys and girls, open your eyes. This is somebody, I, I'm sure the relationship lasted for a while. When it, she discovered the power of Samson, that was exactly what she did. She sold him out. And, and what would they have promised her? Are you with me? What would they have promised her that Samson herself could not have? She sold out his fiancée or boyfriend. Is it not happening in Nigeria? All over the world. Eh? All over the world. Selling people for money. Over here. She handed him to his enemy. And Bible said, he took out his eyes. Wickedness of the highest order. The 
best day of his life. That was what the enemy did. Locked him down and gave him hope. Jesus said, Look, I, when I see people, I see do our people know what they are doing. Let's see the book of Matthew chapter 6. Children, listen. Everybody, make sure you are paying attention. Jesus, the King of Glory, told us. Amen. Amen. Matthew chapter 6, verse 13. Matthew 6, 13, quickly. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Thank you. Jesus, that deliver us from all evil. I know that much you see. Deliver us from the evil one. Or deliver us from the wicked one. There are wicked powers. Wicked people who do not care whether they smash. Jesus said, Men ought always to pray and not sleep. Brothers and sisters, you are hearing me. Do not sleep in the spirit. Things are happening. Even this person that God showed me, I did not actually tell the exact thing. Because I don't want him to go banana. Or was the pure act of wickedness? Amen. Amen. The Bible said they told something. Go ahead, bring him out. Let him begin to dance with you. There rejoices in his heart. There are powers that rejoices when people are suffering. Wickedness. When they do their wicked thing, say, ah, madam, sorry, you. madam, they are the one, no? That's right. Hey, Jesus Christ. They are the same one behind it, say, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Have you seen somebody fire somebody <laughs> at work? He say. Oh man, I'm so sorry. Mm. You are not sorry anything. <laughs> but wickedness. Jesus said, look at him, Jesus. When Jesus was teaching the disciples to pray, he told them to remember to pray, deliver us from the wicked one. That's right. Deliver from evil people. Amen. 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 Let's read Psalm 7, verse 9. Psalm 7, verse 9. Very soon, start to pray. Psalm 7, verse 9. <laughs> oh Lord, let the wickedness of the wicked come to an end, mm-hmm. but establish the jobs. For the David was praying, thank you. David, I don't know how many of you are not there like this. He said, oh no, let there be end to wickedness. Amen. Let the wickedness of the wicked, let it come to an end. Amen. People that you invest your life to support, people that you give money to, people that you spend your life servicing and helping, they go behind you and they do this. People who are contemporaries of your mom, of your dad, of you yourself, getting angry for what? Everybody has their life to live. That's right. My people say the sky is too big for every boat to fly. But we get people. You are here. They say that's your spot. You can't go. Eh? You give them this clue, they say, eh? So you get no glucose. When you give them clothes, they say, eh? you get money to give clothes. When you don't give clothes, they say, ah, you don't get money to give. Are you with me? Right. If you buy that good clothes, they say, eh? she get too much money. You should see the clothes. And if you give them the one that is no good, they say, eh? they hold me. 
wickedness of the wicked. David prayed. He said, let the wickedness of the wicked. Amen. Are you with me? Yes, sir. But what we pray to two dimension. Let's stand up. Samson was not an ordinary man. He mentioned it twice. In verse 7, Judges 16, 7. Judges 16, 7. Samson said, when you buy me with this thing, I'm going to be like an ordinary man. So the power in him was not ordinary. That's right. That power could not be angel. That power could not be wrong until it became there is something extraordinary about you that the enemy is trying to do what? Oh, my father. The best prayer is not. Fill me with your power. Fill me with your power. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Empower me, O Lord. Empower me, O Lord. Holy Spirit. I need your fullness. I need your fullness. Oh, yeah. Pray, 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 pray. Holy Ghost, pray, pray, Jesus, pray. There is, tell all these things. Feel me, feel me. Bend the name of Jesus. Bend the name of Jesus. Bend the name of Jesus. Oh, God, my Father. Try to tell me myself. I receive that fullness of the Father of God as a church. He is in the fullness that the child of God and the name of Jesus might have made for his spirit and power me and power me. I pray for my children. I pray for my wife. I pray for your church. Father and children. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Father. In Jesus' name, what kind of power are we talking about? Power that cannot be used. See, when Samson, before the, she told his, he told his life, right? there was no weapon that the enemy used against him that prospered right. until the power of God left. Mm. When you have power, even when they want to be wicked, they are wicked to talk to Ursula. Father! And deal me with your power. Oh Lord! No. I need your power. I need your fullness. That power to be there. 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 Life is about to play. You are the power to see. I will not lie to you. Say, Father, thank you. It is power to prevail. Thank you, my children. Power to prevail. Power to be. Thank you, my children. Thank you, my children. Thank you, What if I tell you that powers of darkness, they can eat somebody when he's still alive? That's right. Are you with me? Yes, sir. All our children, hear this. Amen. This word is mysterious. Amen. There was somebody when I was young, they say it's sick, they say they already ended. Mm. Ah. That's right. They go up to this pastor, the pastor said it don't finish. It's just a carcass. Mm. They already ended in the mm. My wife is here. When we were in CAC, here, we had a testimony. This woman was sick in the hospital. They are infusing blood. And they infuse blood, blood will dry. You remember? They kept giving blood, and the blood was dry in the hospital. And they were giving the blood. Somebody was there. Uh, but the blood opened the eyes of somebody, too. They kept giving blood. the blood was finished in the hospital. This is not the movie. Oh. Power that is. Some people, the enemy will eat their liver. Mm. They say, get cancer. Which stupid cancer? Man. I'm telling you the That's truth. Right. Most of what you hear is because the enemy messes with you. That's it. right. 
Father, that cannot be touched. Hold on, my father, and fill me with your fire. Every evil decree, every evil decree, 
every degree of wickedness against me, against my family, by the blood of Jesus. I acknowledge you. I bless you. Every degree. Father, help me. Help 
Keep him safe. Protect. I was saying. But in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I pray. He came out to do a big doctor, but you see him in the video. You could see in the video that was tempered. He came up only, he said, You try to kill me, this and that, but I could see even fear. We just have to come out of the life because of who already said he was dead in that. They already say Rest in peace. Mm-hmm. But he, he had to come and say, I did not die. Hallelujah. But in his voice, he told down, he was not wearing suit. He was not wearing suit. Wow. It was a few minutes, mm-hmm. I'm still alive. But I could see fear. Huh? So I want to pray for him again. He just went somewhere to preach the gospel. You know? I want to pray for them again. Say, Father, strengthen him, Lord. Defend him. 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 Now, I want to pray for the particular person that God showed me. Mm. That name was no because it was a, 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 a vicious attack. Go to pray for that man and his wife. Say, Lord! Lord! It was like watching a movie. First of all, I saw the person grab a girl. Then, I mean, when I woke up, I So, <laughs> It was like, what do you do? I want to pray for that man. Say, Father, let me deliver you. Let me stand on the earth. And take it. 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 We are praying the promises of God. Isaiah 60, 18. Violence shall no more be heard in thy land. Wasting nor destruction within thy borders. But thou shalt call thy words salvation Amen. and thy gates praise. Amen. The word of God said there shall be no violence. I remember when you were when we were young, so poor so wicked. They looked at the dog and caught kill just for food. The word of God says, there shall be no violence in our land. Amen. 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 A lot of horror stories. What of the Father? Father. In my camp. No violence. 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 No violence.